streamlined flow the flow of a fluid in which its velocity at any point is constant or changes at regular manner then that flow of fluid is known as a streamlined flow if there is no loss of fluid within the uniform tube the mass of the fluid flowing into the tube at any given time is equal to the mass flowing out of the tube in the same given time now let's try to draw a picture so that we can understand how to define a streamlined flow so here is the picture where you can see i have my point p so this is my point p and let the mass m1 passes through point p and the area of cross section of this end of the tube at point p is a1 and let the fluid entering the tube with a velocity of v1 in the same way let this is point q and let mass m2 is passes through this point q whose cross sectional area is a2 and let the velocity of the fluid leaving point q is v2 then we can say that let us consider a mass m1 is entering the tube at end p of cross sectional area a1 with velocity v1 for time t then the mass entering the tube in time t is given as m1 is equal to rho v1 where rho is the density of the fluid and v1 is the volume of the liquid entering the tube at point p that is equal to rho a1 times x1 where a1 is the area of cross section and x1 is the distance traveled by the fluid in time t and distance is basically velocity times time so we will write that is equal to rho a1 v1 t where a1 is the area of cross section at p v1 is the velocity at which the fluid is entering the point p and t is the time of travel and let this is our equation number 1 similarly let the mass m2 is leaving the tube at point q of cross sectional area a2 and moving with velocity v2 for time t is given as m2 is equal to rho v2 where rho is the density of the fluid and v2 is the volume of the fluid leaving at point q and that is equal to rho a2 x2 where a2 is the area of cross section at point q which is this area right here and x2 is the distance travel in time t and distance is basically velocity times time so we can write that is equal to rho a2 v2 times t and let that is equation number 2 as we know the mass is conserved so we can write m1 is equal to m2 so what we are going to do we are going to write this term is equal to this term so let's write that and if we do that we will write rho a1 v1 times t is equal to rho a2 v2 times t and as you can see rho and t is common on both side so we can easily cancel it out and if we cancel it we will get a1 v1 is equal to a2 v2 and this equation is known as equation of continuity so we can also write av is equal to constant because according to the equation of continuity area times velocity for any fluid is constant if the fluid is a streamlined flow and this equation is also known as flow rate equation and this is how we will define a streamlined flow